Greetings. What a wonderful convention. I hope you all go back to your departments and units with a renewed spirit and purpose. And while you're serving our veterans, military service members and their families, have some fun. Be kind to one another and know your cause is a great one. I have faith in you. But no, I'll be watching. I know you'll keep the promise. Your promise. Our promise. Besides, you've got history behind you. On March 16, 1864, in the midst of war, I made these remarks at a ladies' fair for the benefit of Union soldiers. In this extraordinary war, extraordinary developments have manifested themselves such as not been seen in former wars. And among these manifestations, nothing has been more remarkable than these fairs for the relief of suffering soldiers and their families. And the chief agents in these fairs are the women of America. I have never felt comfortable extending compliments to the fair species. But I must say that if all that has been said by orators and poets since the creation of the world in praise of women were applied to the women of America, it would not do them justice. I will close by saying, God bless the women of America. And 152 years later, at the close of your national convention, I'd like to say, God bless the women of the American Legion Auxiliary.